Thank you. Thank you very much. <coughs> well, dear students, uh, all that I want to say is that, uh, you know, electronic evidence is uh, something which is extremely important uh, for all of us to understand. Uh, given the fact that we are, you know, virtually living in the digital age, you will recall that uh, the Indian Evidence Act uh, was framed more than a hundred years ago, and it's a first class piece of uh, legislation. It has stood the test of time. It has had to deal with a variety of uh, subjects, and in all of them, people have relied upon the Indian Evidence Act not only for criminal cases but also for civil cases. And when we look at digital evidence or electronic evidence, I think we should keep that act in the background in the sense that uh, we should try and see whether we can come out with a document which is as good as the Evidence Act. What I would like to convey to you is that it's not a simple task, understanding electronic evidence. Things change almost every day. Uh, there are new things that are happening. There are unexpected things that are happening. And while we do have some provisions in the uh, Information Technology Act, I believe that uh, many of them are now, you know, fairly useless in the sense that uh, we are dealing with various kinds of problems which the IT Act does not uh, you know, deal with and many provisions which the laws that we have at the present moment, including the Evidence Act, do not deal with. And I would like you, when you go back, to try and discuss and debate. The reason why I say this is that it is more important for a student of law rather than to read what the law is, to understand the law and to live the law. And the only way in which that can be done is when you debate and discuss a legal issue. So I would recommend that uh, some of you form a group which is going to be a prosecutor, some of you form a group which is going to be a defense lawyer, some of you form a group which is going to be a judge and then decide how to deal with a particular problem and you will then realize how complicated the idea of uh, evidence is, particularly that of uh, electronic evidence.